like the old times. Old. <laughs> Even you are drawing your breath, eh? <laughs> okay, did you manage to say the same questions on the game? Would you like to start? Is that possibly the most special win you've had so far since coming back and the man with it? Yeah, the manner of it is uh, like the old days. Like <laughs> I've been part of that so many times myself, and uh, so pleased for the boys that they uh, managed to uh, claw uh, three points out of this game. Because uh, we spoke about it at half time. Just get some more urgency, get uh, ball in the box, uh, play more forward, and the Stratford end will suck that ball in for you. Uh, don't want to take it. Uh, too much away from Andreas and Romelu because uh, there were great finishes but uh, we we felt that that support is that's just part of this club and the history we've done it so many times before quite the contrast seeing Herrera uh, today compared to the, to the Burnley game for example how do you describe his, his development since then so pleased for him so happy for him because uh, He's gone through the academy, uh, we know what he's capable of, he's got loads of energy uh, and drive and we, maybe we found a better position for him than uh, as a number six, he's more of an eight or a ten uh, going forward, he's got high energy, he's got quality in his, in his um, both passing, crossing and shooting, so so pleased for him, goal and an assist, that's a, it's a nice uh, day for him to remember. Your celebration of his goal was a bit more than what we we're used to seeing. Was it, what is it special in that sense? Of course, because uh, young kids at the start of their careers, when they get criticism, there's nothing better than seeing them uh, grabbing a chance when they get it. How do you assess Lukaku? Because sometimes it looks as though he's not playing very well at all. Uh, he is he he's a quality goal scorer. Uh, we need to uh, have him more in front of the goal, of course. But he's done fantastic in his uh, work rate, attitude, and he keeps working every single day on his finishing. He loves scoring goals, he smiles every day when he comes off th after the training because he does extra finishing every day. And that's the way to score goals. If, if, you, if you practice, that, that practice comes out on a Saturday, still Saturday. He's got goal scorer's instinct. Yeah, but he's got goal scorer's qualities, finishing. He knows. He knows what he wants to do and he's got the quality to do it, right foot, left foot. Oli, how's that anxious? Uh, what can you tell us? Well, we don't know yet, we haven't uh, checked it uh, too much. I think it might be the ligaments, it was a bad knock on his knee, so uh, we'll do a scan tomorrow. Uh, hopefully it won't be too bad, but it might. we don't know until we've done the scan. You, you said as a player, of course, you've played in a lot of games like that. Can you yeah. describe what it's like as a player when you've sort of got that momentum going <coughs> It's just kind of inevitable that you're going to get that way. You forget that you're tired. You just run and you just want that ball to be d delivered in and around the, the box because you know that uh, with the quality we have, we, we might win the game. I've do we've done it so many times. I've been... Uh, but as a manager, you've, that's not uh, the way you want to... Not endure, but enjoy the first 90 minutes the, you want to be comfortable and it looked like it the first five minutes I thought we should have been two up but some great fin uh, great uh, goalkeeping saves by the kids then the game stopped a bit and they uh, wow what th them two strikes for them uh, absolute quality you can't um, cannot knock the quality of them got a bit of momentum up now before Wednesday yeah, the boys, the dressing room was, of course, bouncing. They were happy, looking forward to Wednesday. We know it's going to be a tough game. We know that we're playing against one of the best teams in Europe with some absolute quality players, but who knows? It's happened before. This club has had so many great comebacks. Uh, Champions League the last few years has also given quite a few of those comebacks. PSG, for example, against Barcelona, even though it's the other way around, we have a... And even we have to do it away from home but we've got eight straight wins we are confident away from home um, if we're in the game with 20-30 minutes to go who knows Oli, um, has been very successful with penalties yep. not, not today is there a danger that goalkeepers will, will, will read him and he might have to change his, 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 his taking style? I think uh, I just said to him there just get ready for the next one because you're going to take that one as well it's I've missed penalties. He's a confident boy. He wants to go uh, and take the next one. That's you want that character in in boys, and 
I don't. Today was one of the ones he really blasted. Uh, normally he just places him, so um, he'll be okay.